All right. And what about my my entire what, what about the entire thing with my brother? The entire thing with your brother was to draw your ass out so I could speak to you, dumb fuck. You are saying this was your entire plan from the start? Yes. All right. Uh, I'll figure out what the fuck to do with my brother. Well, I mean, and, your brother uh, blew up my car. Let, you know, tell him you know, even we're squared. Sorry about all that shit. I didn't speak. All right. Well, at least we got this sorted. Yeah, well, uh, tell your brother again, I, you know, I apologize, but now uh, that I know why uh, you're around, uh, please, bombs. Like, anyway, it's taken care it. of. He's not going to bother you. No, he needs to apologize and not say I'm a fucking terrorist on Twitter. Call him. I have nothing to say to him. If he, if he, think, if he thinks that he spews random shit about me randomly like that, nah, fam. I'm still not going to get between that. I, I took care of the things I wanted to get to. If I don't show up, then uh, he killed me. What, he actually killed you? I thought you guys were brought, like, you guys don't like each other? Nancy, help. <laughs> uh, they are constantly cleaning up each other's messes. Let's just say that. So if Nick finds out what has happened, love hate relationship, I'd say. It's a, yeah. It's is a this only I am to you? You're fucking janitor. Clean up your shit. The fuck you? Why the fuck did he decide to come after me and us? He literally said that because I was dead, he was gonna take it out on you. Excuse me. Fuck him. Yes. So you were the punching bag because he couldn't punch. I'm gonna show him a punching bag. I took care of it. You can leave it and then we can move on or... I ain't accepting that. I can't believe you accepted that either. <sighs> if somebody told me that you were their punching bag, motherfucker, I would have destroyed them. You can't just destroy everything in your fucking path, though. I can! It has worked <laughs> out can. fantastically throughout our entire lives, Michael. So why are you letting him treat me as a punching bag? You might not give a shit about others, but I still care. Huh? Who are you? I quite literally had zero beef with Buddha. I had absolutely nothing to say to the man. And he decides to fucking defame me on Twitter and then has the balls and the audacity to call, offer money for information about your death. And then has the audacity to tell you, you're my brother, by the way, that he used me as a punching bag. Excuse me? He claimed that he did all of this to get me out of the woodworks, which is bullshit. But Fuck that's him. also what he claimed. Like, how fucked up is not that? And you, you're claiming that this is some grand scheme because you care about your friends. What about your fucking brother? Well, that's what I mean. You're not going to give a fuck about anyone else. I'm sorry, but a friend would have said, that's fucked up. A brother would have said, I'm going to murder you. Kind of fucked. Yeah. Well, so is going after a person for a fucking tweet and blowing up his shit and leaving my fucking spray on it. I heard him speak saying he was going after our business, not just a tweet. He had a personal vendetta evident in that fucking meeting room. Would it have just been a tweet? I wouldn't, have, I wouldn't have given a fuck. That he had a meeting that spoke about taking our money, our work. But I responded was he in... going to... Yes, was he, he said going to take it? He was trying to. Buddha being like, oh, we need to take this, uh, we need him out of here, blah, blah. So at your first assumption was just going to blow their shit up? It was a message. That was all. Like his fucking Twitter and his oh God, state announcement and his meetings. Oh. You, you can't put this on Cleo either. <laughs> I, mean, I, I mean, at the end of the day, Buddha chooses to listen, right? Yeah, and he chose to listen to fucking Cleo. When he said the punching back thing, you want him to pull out my gun and shoot him right there. No, then. You, you laid down like a little dog. That's what you did. I think that's fucked, oh. Michael. I generally think that's I fucked. Look at the bigger picture. I, I still think you just rolling over and being like, hey, Buddha, use my brother as a punching bag. That's I never said he could use you as a punching well, bag. No. You didn't address it. I don't remember what I said. I don't know, man. I am disappointed. I I thought we had our each other's back no matter what. And I feel like you're... I, I don't know what the fuck has happened to you, but you're, you've gone soft or weird or some shit. And I've gone soft because of words. <laughs> what? Nothing. All right. Well, at least I know where your true uh, alliance is lying, man. Where is that? With your friends. I need these fucking bombs. I need a lot of them. All right. That's not how I was expecting my Monday to go. Jackpot. Two individuals, male, female. That's all we need. They're leaving now. now. I, I'm gonna try to get my car and see if I can find them again, but I, I gotta run pretty far, so. That's the fucking going run! You okay? What the fuck is wrong with you, man? Sorry, man. I, I got a fucking call. There's a chase happening. 
medical pads by chance? No, I'm good, but what the fuck are okay, you doing? Thank God. I, I was trying to U-turn, sir. This, you can't U-turn on an off-ramp. Well, you know, I, with the lights out, I can't. Yeah, let, me, let me knock you loose. I got you, I got you. There you go, there you go. You're fine, uh -huh, you're fine. Uh -huh, you'll be safe, okay? Uh -huh. I cannot be seen again, bro. I cannot be seen again. I'm switching cars. Ryan! Why are you responding with radio? Yo, listen. Yeah, yeah, what happened? I just went down towards LSIA and I seen the same car in a different color. Well, not the same, but it's the same. It's also an Audi, like high spec. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's burgundy color and I, I like sent it down to LSIA and he like went past me. So after like yeah. a little bit, I did a U turn. And I wanted to return, and right as I did, he fucking full frontal crashed into me. So I had a little conversation, like, you need medical, you're okay, so I have a car to go to. It was Nicholas yeah. Simone. Right on. Bing bang. <laughs> My brain is on one today. Yeah, I can tell. What the fuck are you doing? Michael? 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 Yeah, I'm still not gonna get between that. I, I took care of the things I wanted to get, take care of. I ain't accepting that. I can't believe you accepted that either. Got me feeling so stuck. I think that I'm on plug. Did my brain is no Serotonin not enough. Fit my bed like a glove. And my eyes feel shut. And my mind feels numb. Is this all I am to you? You're fucking janitor. Clean up your shit. The fuck you. I feel like I've been on the same damn fucking loop. Know that it's all in my brain, but it's fucking true. Cause I can't see. I, I still think you just rolling over and being like, hey, Buddha, use my brother as a punching bag. That's I never said he could use you as a punching bag. Well, you didn't address it. On the I'll put him on the couch. He's here. We have mild burns, and he's thinking of um. I think I think vodka. Um, the hell? I don't know. He's he's not feeling good. He's awake, but he's just a bit groggy. So I'm just gonna leave him here. Okay. What did you do? I had a. I had something to drink. Something to drink. Yeah. Was well, it a? Was it a what was it? 
of a bottle of vodka. Had bo why are you drinking bottles of vodka? It's Monday. Surgery? No, he did not have surgery, apparently. The doctor okay. lied for him. He's fine. He's in his office. What? Why is there... Why was there fire trucks that this place then? Uh, he lit on fire a little bit, I think. Nick, of Nick, all people, can you lit on that fire. You lit on fire. Oh, uh, it's pretty litty. Are you drunk? <laughs> no. He's drunk. And yes, he lit on fire. He's drunk and he lit on fire. And now he's at the hospital in his office, <laughs> laying on his couch. Oh, he's not good. So the first thing he does is storm out of here, go get fucking wasted, and light himself on fire. Yes, that is what it sounds like. Oh my god. I'm with him now, so... Also, uh, Trey is taking care of the thing for laying. I'm, I told no, him okay. to... Yeah, I told him to... I told him to tell Lang that if he wants more, he has to fucking stop with the big balls bullshit that he has going with Nick and actually call and apologize. Or Ooh. something. Okay, that's great. Yes, okay. thank you. Okay. At least I have a, a tiny bit of a brain left. Okay, well, I'm proud of you. Yeah, thank you. All right, okay. have fun. All right, bye-bye. Hey, buddy. Uh, How are you? Uh, What's going on? Nothing. Nothing's going on, huh? Mm -mm. He's having a rough day. Mm -hmm. There, there. There, there. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, I kind of want to be alone for a little bit. Yeah, nope, that's not happening. Sorry. <laughs> Why'd you get drunk and light yourself on fire? I don't know. Does it have to do with the conversation that you had with Michael? Get out, please. Men are so fragile. Oh my god.